Hello, this is Richard White with a five-minute tutorial on using checksums to verify a file in OS X. A checksum is a small string of characters that are produced when one runs a hash algorithm on a file. The value of the hash is created by carefully examining the bits of data in the file, and an alteration in even one bit of data will result in a completely different checksum result. Two copies of the same file should produce the same checksum. If the checksums from the two files are different, we can conclude that the two files are not identical. One of them is different, either because it has been accidentally corrupted, or perhaps because it has been deliberately tampered with. People who distribute software often publish the checksum for their files so that users who download them can verify and trust those files. Here, I'm going to download the new version of LibreOffice onto my OS X machine. Whether I choose to download the file directly from LibreOffice's servers or from BitTorrent, I'll be able to confirm that the file is legitimate by using the checksum. While the file is downloading, let's see what info there is available on this file. You can see that there's lots of information here associated with these files. I'm interested in MD5, which is one kind of hashing algorithm or SHA-1, or especially SHA-256, which is a more secure algorithm. Take note of these checksum values here. We'll use them in just a moment with our file. Once the file is downloaded, I'm going to do a checksum on that file. I can do that by opening up the terminal located in the Utilities folder of my applications. Navigate to the directory where my file is contained, and run the OpenSSL command on that file using the hash algorithm that I want. I'll use MD5 here. You can see the result that is produced. How does this compare with the published MD5 hash from LibreOffice's website? They're the same, which indicates that the files are identical. I can trust that the file I downloaded is the same file that LibreOffice wants me to install on my computer. For even more security, use the SHA-256 checksum to verify that the files are identical. This is Richard White, and this has been a brief tutorial on how to use checksums to verify a file in OS X. Thanks for watching.